Hey yo, what's up guys, your boy Clarence Pro Gamer here, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be unboxing the Scorpion Stingy for Collector Box. I'll give you guys the full look of the Collector Box and everything inside it. I'll give you guys a taste test review and I'll be talking about it a little bit in this video and um, give you guys my perspective view on the flavor if I like it or not. I'll be, I'm going to be straight up honest, I'm excited for this. We're coming back to G Fuel collab was absolutely sick. That's something that I didn't expect at all. It was awesome what they did, G Fuel did. An awesome collab, just like the Sonic one. I can't wait to give you guys my full perspective view on this flavor. Boxes, you know, collect the box for you guys. I'm excited. I'll be unboxing the Sub Zero G Fuel collector box as well. I'll be in a separate video, so I can give you guys the full look of it and a taste test review on that flavor as well. I'm excited for both Scorpion and Sub Zero. They're absolutely sick. Two popular characters that this um, GFA decided to do with this collab. So, uh, it's their own, very own flavor, some checkers. I'm gonna leave this on the floor because it's big. Okay, I got you the Scorpion Sting G4 Collector Box right here. As you can see, the tub and the shaker cup inside, Mortal Kombat in the front, in the side, Mortal Kombat 11 the back simple design but it's a, it's a nice design from the top g fuel bottom absolutely nice design open this bad boy up real quick there's no there's no there's no sticker or a g fuel to go scooper just the top and the shaker i'm gonna start off with the top first Give you guys a full look of the scorpion tub. That's actually a nice design. Fire theme, black. Scorpion in the front. Give you guys a better look. Oh, the front. I don't know if you guys can see that. Absolutely nice. The flavor, scorpion's thing, is like a spicy mango. Like a Hispanic, Hispanic flavor, I guess spicy mango because we hispanics have that kind of lollipop and stuff but i'll give you the full look of the g for shaker cup transparent more comeback 11 in the front in the back g for logo yellow transparent yellow lid black black piece inside full look of the inside a nice simple color something we've never seen before I'm gonna get a G4 Shaker Cup with some ice cubes and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. I got my PewDiePie G4 Shaker Cup. I may be using a clear one so you guys can see the color scheme of the flavor. Now, let me open this bad boy up. I love that sound when I open a brand new tub. You hear that? Mmm, satisfying. I'm gonna smell this first before I put anything in my Shaker Cup to give you guys my thoughts on what I smell. Oh, that smells good. It smells like, it reminds me of a um, mango candy. Like a Pacific mango candy. Not Hispanic kind, but like uh, American kind. Oh yeah. It smells like a mango candy. That's the only thing I'm eating really. Not, nothing spicy, no other smell. Just a mango candy vibe. Let's go in. Side. Okay, I'm gonna shake it up and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. I shaked it up very well. As you can see, the color scheme is like a dark medium yellow or like a well, yellow mixed with orange. I don't know really. It's hard to tell, but you guys can see that. It's a, like a yellow mixed with orange. I'm gonna smell this real quick before I start drinking it. Oh, yep. I could smell a bit of spicy in there now. With the um, with mango, this um in the powder form the spicy wasn't there, but now when mixed with liquid, the spicy is there. I can smell it a little bit. Oh yeah, now that smells like the friggin' um Hispanic lollipops. It's a uh, spicy mango lollipop. That's what it reminds me from the, the Hispanic candies. Just give this a taste. Oh. 
that spice kicked in. Oh, that's actually good. You can taste the spicy a little bit in there. It's not that strong or not that light, but it go like it doesn't like when you first drink it, it doesn't you don't feel it until like the back of your throat. I can feel it a little bit in the back of my throat, the spiciness. But I mainly taste mango in this. Yeah, like I could taste the spiciness in the back of my throat, but I could taste mostly the mango when I first when I drink it and the aftertaste. But the aftertaste leaves a little um like the little bit of spice in the back of the throat, and it kind of reminds me of the Hispanic lollipops I was talking about. If you guys don't know what the um, what I'm talking about, I'll leave a picture in the screen right now. But that's what it reminds me of, Hispanic lollipops, and it kind of tastes a little bit like it because of the mango and the spice, but tastes a little bit, the mango tastes a little bit lighter, a little bit lighter, but it's a good flavor overall. The spiciness that goes back in my throat is uh, something that I don't really like, but it's a good flavor. I'll give this like, my ratings, I'll give this like a um, seven out of 10. Not a bad flavor. Hopefully the Sub-Zero is a bit better than this one since it's like a raspberry with ice but hopefully it's a little better I'll, I'll make a separate video on that unboxing and my taste test review on it and everything but overall decent flavor not bad not a good but 7 out of 10 I just don't really like the spicy nip that kicks in the back of my throat but that's all in today's video thank you guys for watching I'll catch you on the next one peace